Hey, you mind identifying? Hey, you mind identifying yourself, bro? Name and badge number, bro. Why? Why? Cause he's your policy. Yeah, that's why. Duty, you're on duty, man. Nah, wow. wanna be one of them douchebags? I mean, that's yeah, hundred percent. You know, you, you so you can tell you listen, know about the First Amendment, listen, man. It's freedom we, of the press. We work for the people, yeah, bro. You've never messed with yeah. Minecraft. No, I'll be honest. I like watching your stuff because <laughs> reason, reason. This is a public service announcement brought to you in part by. To witness the strength of the rightful police and war. Here we go. Oh. No. Listen. What's going on, guys? This is our first cop watch. First cop watch without Jason Real, Jason Real Camera. It's dedicated to you, brother. Right here. I film police and what? Keeping the legacy going for my brother, Jason Real Camera. Good, man. Good, man. Good, bro. You need badge number, man? Sure. Name is Sergeant Artola, badge number 1166. Appreciate that, brother. You too. Take care, man. Yeah, you too, brother. Hey, you mind identifying yourself, bro? Name and badge number, bro? Why? Why? Because he's your policy. Yeah, that's why. Man. You're on duty, man. Nah, I want to be one of them douchebags. Why? Hey, Sergeant, you need, to, you need to educate him on identifying, bro. Sergeant, quick question. Why does the officer put his finger like on the back of the trunk when he does a traffic stop? You see when he walked past the vehicle, he put his finger on it like he touched it. Put his finger on the... Car? Yeah, he did it twice. Yeah, normally you check to make sure that the trunk is closed in case if anybody pops out. But also sometimes what they do it for is in case if that vehicle ends up uh, taking off on, let's say, God forbid, we get shot or something. 
and we have a description of the vehicle the vehicle takes off and they want to check to see normally that's like a normal thing that you know that we'll do is touch it so then our prints on it just in okay. case so that they know what the vehicle is all right i heard about that but i wasn't sure of it yeah all right all right yeah, yeah, thank yeah. you sorry can i um just ask you uh that officer that i was speaking to right there that just got in the car mm -hmm. can you identify uh, him for me bro yeah that's officer rosado Rosado, you don't yeah. know his badge number, huh? Um, let me see. I can get it for you. You're a sergeant? Yes. Yeah, I can tell. You. Thank you, man. You're very professional, no problem, bro. Man. This is what we expose, man. No, tranquilo. Good That's... and bad. And he didn't want to identify. He asked him for his name and badge number. He said, why? Okay. It's his policy, bro. We're the public. Yep. That's all, man. A lot of them are new, so they don't. Well, they don't man, they should teach y'all in the so, academy. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's. Yeah, 100%. You know, you, you, so you can tell you listen, know about the First Amendment, listen, man. The freedom we, of the press. We work for the people. Yeah, bro. That's what we want to hear, bro. And and a lot of times, some forget that. Absolutely, we're so, human. But as you're yeah. working as a, with the badge and the gun, they should be professional. They should yes. learn that 100%. it's a real simple, simple, simple policy. 100%. Let, me, job, let me get his badge number. Bro, this guy's this guy's this guy's on Sorry, point, bro. And you know our activity. You know who we are. We've never messed with blind yeah. No, I'll be honest. I like watching your stuff because <laughs> reason reason being is because. Sometimes, since we're a smaller jurisdiction, yeah, we don't get to see all the stuff that a lot of other absolutely. People. And then sometimes you guys bring stuff into life. Yeah, bro. Like, oh, that's true. Absolutely, oh, bro. We're just yeah. about look professionalism, transparency, oh. all that, man. You know, like you guys watch yeah. us. We got a right to watch you guys and keep of you course. all on check. That's all. Of course. You know. Thanks, Thank no you, problem, appreciate man. it, man. Let me let him give him the badge number. You're gonna look good on the channel, man. That's what we want to do, bro. You just really? expose good. I just he's, calling, he's calling. He's uh, calling you for, for the badge Patrol. number. Police chase here, man. It's a good oh, one. Oh yeah. <laughs> You'll like it. Okay. I got the dash cam videos from FHP. But let me tell you, you've lost weight though. You look thinner. <laughs> you look thinner. A little thinner. Hey, Torres, can you do me a favor? Uh, give me um, Rosado's badge number. This guy's on point. Good to you. We want to see you, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, we'll leave right now. I'm hungry too. So let me get that badge number real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's giving me a sorry for your loss, bro. I got a little meat. Let's see my shit. I don't know why that cop had an attitude. 1760. 1760? What was his name again? Rosado. Rosado. Hey, thank you for being professional, man. Keep it up. And educate him on that, bro. That's all it is about, bro. You have a safe night. All right, man. This is what you want to see, ladies and gentlemen. This is what we're about. You see what I'm saying? Nah, you're good. You're good. You're good. Rack of Monkey represent. This, is for, this was for you, Jay Surreal, my brother. Keeping his legacy alive, ladies and gentlemen. That's the first, this is the first cop watch without him. And um, it's devastating, but I gotta keep strong for him. Cause this is what he wants, he would want me to do. And uh, keep the Miami on point. All right guys, catch you on the next one.